Sister Wives, Christine and David's wedding special shows how much love Christine Brown receives from her family and David Woolley on her special day. Sister Wives star Christine Brown walked down the aisle with David Woolley in a brand new preview of her wedding special. The reality star was in an incompatible relationship with her polygamous ex, Kobe Brown, for nearly 30 years. She craved love and wanted to find someone who truly cared for her. In 2023, Christine revealed she finally found her match in David. She revealed he was her soulmate and didn't waste much time before introducing him to her family. The following year, Christine married David, surrounded by her family. She allowed TLC to film her beautiful ceremony. The second part of Christine and David's wedding, which wraps up Sister Wives season 18, airs January 14. Recently, TLC shared a sneak peek from the episode and showed how the pair shared some beautiful moments together. The preview clip reported by People featured David waiting for Christine as she walked down the aisle with her son, Peyton Brown. The mom of six grabbed her son's arm as he slowly walked her to his new stepdad. There's my goddess, there's my queen, my unicorn, the new Sister Wives star said in a confessional while remembering the unforgettable moment and making Christine blush with love. The preview clip also filmed some significant reactions from the family members. One moment from the video showed Christine embracing her dad while walking to the altar. She said, hey daddy, as her father Rex hugged her tight and shared some kind words. He responded, wonderful day, honey, he's a wonderful man. The Sister Wives cast member thanked her father for her love as he assured her emotionally. Rex added, you guys are gonna love each other. Janelle Brown then claimed it was heartwarming to see Christine share that moment with her father. She claimed, it feels right. Christine's heartwarming wedding was the perfect celebration she needed to restart her life again. The former polygamist was truly miserable for nearly 30 years with Cody. While the Sister Wives cast member did welcome six kids with a man, she never really got true respect and care in return. When Christine divorced Cody in November 2021, she entered uncharted waters full of uncertainty. She received a lot of criticism for betraying her religion and not following through with her past commitments. Christine would probably regretted leaving her old life behind if it hadn't been for David and his love. It was also great to see Christine's family members support her as she tried something new. Most of her relatives attended the ceremony and seemed happy in the preview clip. The standout moment was when Christine hugged her father, who has supported her throughout her life. The old man was there for his daughter when she was in a polygamous relationship with Cody, and he was there for her during her divorce. Now he came to cheer her on at her wedding with the love of her life. Rex seemed genuinely happy about the sister wives Tavar's new journey with David. Christine Brown, known for her role in Sister Wives, got married to David Woolley in October 2023, starting a new chapter in her life. After 25 years of a spiritual marriage with Cody Brown, Christine found love again, making a big change in her personal life. Christine shared her relationship with David on Valentine's Day in 2023, expressing how he brought a breath of fresh air to her soul. Their love story progressed quickly, leading to a romantic proposal in April during a weekend getaway in Utah. The couple tied the knot on October 7, 2023 in Moog, Utah with about 300 guests at the wedding. The ceremony was a dream come true for Christine, who had envisioned a traditional celebration. The wedding moments were featured on TLC's Christine and David's wedding special, capturing the magical day. David Woolley is not only Christine's husband, but also a proud grandpa. His Instagram showcases heartwarming moments with his daughter Caddy's three young sons, emphasizing the joy of being a grandparent. The couple seamlessly blends their families, creating lasting memories and going on adventures together. Woolley has become an integral part of Christine's family, especially connecting with her daughter Truly. The trio had a memorable family vacation to Los Angeles, exploring popular attractions and enjoying quality time at the beach. Their Instagram posts reflect the happiness of creating cherished memories. The couple has sweet nicknames for each other, with Woolley calling Christine his queen, reciprocated by her as king. Their social media posts are filled with love and appreciation for each other, creating an atmosphere of mutual adoration. Christine's fairy tale wedding to David Woolley took place in Moog, Utah a few months ago, but aired in a TV special on January 7. Among the 330 guests, only Janelle Brown from the Sister Wives was invited while Cody, Robin, and Mary were not. Now a source is sharing how Mary felt about being snubbed from the October 7 nuptials. Mary didn't care about attending, a source told the US Sun. Truthfully, she could care less. They had a falling out and have been distant ever since Christine left the family and moved to Utah. The source continued, They were never close as Sister Wives or best friends for that matter. There is no love lost between them. Christine and Cody announced their split in November 2021 after 25 years of marriage. A few months later, she moved to Utah, leaving Cody and her sister wives behind in Flagstaff, Arizona. 
In December 2022, Mary and Janelle have also announced their separation from Cody. Mary has since reportedly moved into her bed and breakfast in Parowan, Utah as of April of last year, which is only a few hours away from Christine and David's $770,000 home in Leahy. A source told the U.S. Sun that a reason why Leon Brown's mother isn't so bothered by the wedding invite is because she's happy with her life away from the sister wives. The thing about Mary is she is really happy with her life right now, a source said. Aside from not having Cody in her life, she has found her peace. The source continued, She's not lacking anything in her life at all. She doesn't have animosity or anger. She's in a really good place, and that makes her not care so much about what the other wives who she's not even close to are up to. Mary's latest social media posts have been with other family and friends of hers that she appears to spend most of her time with. The U.S. Sun has reached out to TLC for comment. Since Mary was not at the wedding, TLC cameras filmed an interview with her as she was decorating Lizzie's Heritage Inn for Halloween. It was then that she revealed that she knew Christine was getting married soon but did not know the exact date. She confessed to cameras, I'm really happy for Christine. I know that she's really just been wanting to find some peace and some happiness for a really long time so I'm really glad that she's found it. Cody's first wife recently shared more of her feelings about Christine in his Sister Wives special that aired in December. She admitted, at the time that she first was telling us about leaving, that's really how I felt. I felt very betrayed by her and that she was leaving me too. Cause she has always said, I didn't just want the man, I want the sister wives. She added, I know what kind of relationship she and I have had in the past. It's been fun. It's not been super, super deep, but it's been a lot of fun and I miss that. I missed that for a lot of years with her. In the last season of Sister Wives, Mary filmed scenes with Cody and Robin, who she remained close to following the family rift. The father of 18 even helped move Mary to a different state as she settled in Utah after listing her Arizona home for rent. A source previously told the U.S. Sun that the Lula Roe ambassador hasn't given up on her marriage to Cody. The source explained, She might have separated from him, but she's not ever going to leave him leave him. She's going to wait for him to come back. The source went on to say that a big telling reason why she's not ready to move on is because she has rarely gone on any dates. She might not find love again because she's really not putting in the effort. The insider claimed, She's perfectly okay with being independent and just enjoying this time with her friends and focusing on her businesses. Despite Mary posting pictures with various males sparking dating rumors, the source said that they're just friends. The sister wives' family and RVs go hand in hand. While members have lived in RVs at different phases of their lives, apparently Janelle Brown was the trendsetter of the clan who first decided to move into a trailer. That was further followed by Robin's son Dayton as well. But now it seems that Christine and David are planning to have new adventures and will perhaps move into their brand new super expensive RV. Are they really preparing to shift in a trailer? What are they up to now? Sister Wives star Christine purchased her first house with David Woolleyway before they walked down the aisle. Their dream home is worth $770,000 in Lehi, Utah, the four bedrooms and 2.5 bathrooms. It is a perfect fit for the couple as well as truly. Yet Christine and David ended up making a costly purchase of an RV. They spent around $90,000 on it, which is currently parked in the driveway area of their house. This made the viewers wonder if the couple was now planning to move into an RV and explore new locations. Apparently, one of their neighbors has confirmed that Christine and David are thinking of taking a country tour in it. This pointed out the possibility of Christine now living the same life as Janelle, though initially she wasn't really in favor of later living in a trailer. It seems that now she is open to exploring new horizons. Moreover, Sister Wives viewers believe that David is adventurous and loves to try new things. Hence, there is a fair chance that Christine would also consider the same for the sake of her husband. But on the other hand, David and Christine have already worked really hard to make their residence look like their dream house. So it seems that her move into an RV wouldn't be a permanent one and would be on a temporary basis, just for fun. Christine and David have already taken several trips together before walking down the aisle. They went on family vacations and solo outings as well. Hence, it appears that the new Sister Wives couple wanted to do something different when it came to their honeymoon. Some sources recently confirmed that Christine and David were planning to take a road trip. They would be exploring the country in their new motorhome. The couple is simply waiting for the weather to fall in their favor and soon, they will be on their trip. Several pictures of Christine and David's RV also started to surface on the internet. It was covered in heavy snow while it was parked behind a white fence. As per the reports, the couple's new vehicle has a special queen-size bed. Not only this, but it can also accommodate up to six people at a time. It also has a bathroom and a shower that is accompanied by a well-furnished kitchen that has a refrigerator and stove as well. Hence, it is evident that Christine and David won't have to face any difficulties while they live on their new purchase.
Ever since Christian Brown debuted her new man on Valentine's Day last year, Talks of how fast her relationship has been going kept making rounds, especially after her now husband David Woolley popped the question two months later, and in less than six months they tied the knot. The speed at which their relationship has been going raised a lot of eyebrows, mostly from her close family members. Her children Peyton Brown and Gwendolyn Brown once spoke up about the fast pace, but in the end, they wished their mom who was love starve in her previous marriage happiness. Her best friend and fellow sister wife Janelle Brown also shared her two cents on the matter, but you know what they say about reasoning with someone in love. Recently, a source close to the 51-year-old told the US Sun exclusively that some of Christine's friends have joined the list of those concerned about her marriage to David. The revelation came after the first episode of their wedding special aired on Sunday, January 7. The source told the outlet, a lot of people in Christine's inner circle are concerned about her quick marriage to David. They just aren't going around voicing it to everyone because they don't want to take away from Christine's happiness and having her moment ruined, but they feel like she rushed into this marriage. They continued, she's totally different with him, the source insisted. She's showing off her tattoos, she's doing things she's never done before, and she's showing her wild side that people have never seen before. It doesn't mean it's a bad thing, it's just friends are concerned that she might be forgetting her roots and how she was raised. The insider also revealed that two of Christine's children, Aspen, 28 and Sable, 20, have their guard up against David. They went on to explain, the reason why the girls are not into him is because they refuse to get attached. They have some doubts and believe it's not going to last. 